in November 2017 as the thick smog engulfed the Delhi NCR region. The air quality index value was severe. So the district administration enforced the Graded Response Action Plan. All the schools were closed. The Badarpur power plant was shut. Diesel generators banned, hundreds of brick kilns ordered to stop production and several other restrictions on construction and parking fee was increased. Systems are now going to get tested. Because you have taken the decision now, you also need a quick response uh, from the system to ensure that they do the emergency action very quickly. So if there is a delayed effect, then you are uh, going to lose the advantage. We were asked to make this great response action plan. Uh, the challenge was that it has to be based on science. And we don't you know, want to have a plan based on perceptions. So we looked at the data, we looked at the variations, seasonal variations, and we were able to identify as to which are the critical periods in a year when you have more problems. Along with the emergency plan, it is crucial that there is strict implementation of the existing rules, such as controlling crop burning, open burning and landfill fires, implementing traffic rules, stopping the spread of fly ash, and regulating brick kilns. The government of India and Delhi government and the NCR of the governments which are ruling these cities, they should have made a the precautionary principle that there should be, there should be no occasion that the air pollution should increase beyond the permissible limits. It is critical to develop long-term solutions rather than going into an emergency situation, while the centre is responsible for emissions and other related issues. But when it comes to improving the bus system, the road dust management, waste burning or parking policy, all of it is with the state government. But even citizens need to step up and work towards cleaner and healthier air.